Good afternoon, everyone. Um, one of the things that I did not mention yes in yesterday's um, introduction video is that um, I'm a shopaholic. Um, I enjoy um, the thrill of the hunt. I am a clearance bargain shopper, whatever you want to call it. Um, one of my favorite stores here lately has been the Dollar Tree. Um, just because you can um, get so many different craft ideas from there. Um, so in today's video, I want to do a Dollar Tree haul. We just had one that, um, a new Dollar Tree that opened up not too far from the house. So I went in there to see what it was all about and see if I could find some things that my other stores didn't have. Um, so um, let's get into it. So I found these um, carrot picks. Um, again, a lot of what's going to be in this haul is going to be more for my crafts that I'm going to be doing. Um, some crafts that I know, um, kind of have ideas for others that I'm just buying because I haven't seen them anywhere else and, um, I'm sure I'll use them. But this has a two piece, uh, carrot picks from Crafter Square. I thought these would be a cute idea, um, either to use in a wreath or, um, in a tear tray. So I got those and some of these I did get um, duplicates just to have um, again I got uh, this uh, the bunny butts um, this comes in a pack of six um, again I thought that this would be cute uh, for a DIY and they, it looks like it's more like it's felt um, and it is made by crafter square as well I've got two of these, just one in each color, I believe. Um, but these are the felt fabric gingham with bow. Um, I thought these would be cute either um, to do as a DIY, DIY or um, DIY, I should say, um, or put it on, use it um, on a wreath. So I've got the pink, pink and white gingham and then the blue and white gingham. And they come, each one has six pieces. I got all that they had of these. Um, these are the Craftwood 3D Bugs. They're the Ladybugs. So I've got two packs of these. And they are wood with the, um, it does have a um, sticker back. And then they also had the bumblebees. And I thought these were really, really cute. And it, it comes with 12 pieces. And this was found in the garden section. Um, I got these gemstones here. Um, they're in the shape of a butterfly. I thought these would be cute to use on some of my hair bows that I make. Um, and this comes with 32 pieces. It's made by Crafter Square as well. But it comes with all kinds of different colors. Um, and it's the flat back. I got a couple more Easter picks. Um, these are the egg picks. Um, this is the, the larger ones. These are the five piece. They come in the blue, the purple, the pink, and the yellow up here have, um, looks like orange design on them and they come with a bow. And then they also had um, this this pack that comes with 10 pieces um, with all the different colors. Again, um, using this as a DIY or, you know, using it in a wreath or um, a tear tray um, on a sign, something like that. Again, the ideas will come to me or I'll find something on YouTube. Somebody else has used them. Um, I got this uh, Color Your Own Ornaments, and these are the bunny rabbits. So I thought I'd get these. Again, I'm going to probably use these for my tear tray. Or it does have the hole in it. You can actually make a garland out of these. So that may be another idea. It does come with a string. It comes with 10 pieces. Got these ice cube trays. Um, this has the little bunny butts. I don't know if you can see that. And these are the bunny faces. 
It looks like there's two different ones. This is the little boy, and then this is the girl that has the, um, the flower in the ear. And then the boy comes with a little um, bow. So um, I got these to either try to make some freshies out of them, but if that doesn't work, then maybe put some resin. So I got one of each of those. Um, I got a pack of these. These are more for my junk journaling um, and for my craft room. Um, it's just the reusable dry erase pockets. Um, I got them in different colors. Like I said, I could probably use it in my craft room, put it on the wall, um, put different types of vinyl in them. Or I may use them for my junk journaling um, to put different types of um, pages in them. I got this um, eyelash case with a mirror. I thought that was pretty cute. I don't wear eyelashes very often, but um, you know, if I do, then it comes with a mirror and then also it comes where you can put um, a couple of different um, eyelashes on there and as a travel case with you to take with you. Um, this is the only design that I saw was with the cherries. So I thought that was pretty cute for $1.25. I don't have any of the plus stores in my area. I think um, we have a couple of plus items. I think it's more of the food um, so I got one pack of this that has three, um, of the shallow square containers with lids. I use this to put my freshy molds in, um, and then I label them, um, on there what each mold is. So it's just easier to find. And then I put it on the shelf. Um, it just, this seems to work so far for putting all my molds in and keeping them more organized. So I usually try to pick one of those up every time I go. I got another set of these felt um, decors. These are the gnomes. Um, looks like it's two different kinds. Got one with the orange cat with a green, looks like a carrot, and then um, just a more of a light tan hat, but they are gnomes. See if you can see that. And there it comes in a pack of six. I got another um, set of bunnies. These are wood bunnies. It comes with the little, it's like the bunny butt with the little, um, what do you call that? Anyways, um, so I thought these would be cute to put different colors, different designs on them. And um, do a couple of DIYs. These would look great on, um, you can put them on uh, signs. You can use them in your tear trays. Um, a lot of different kinds of uh, DIYs that you can do with these. Um, this comes in a pack of 12. And they're kind of, they're pretty small. Um, another set of wood ornaments I got was these are Carrots. Again, you could paint these and use these on signs. Um, you can even use them on wreaths um, or, you know, just as just sitting around as decoration. Comes in a pack of 14 and they are, you know, pretty small. I got two packs of these. These are the craft eggs. Um, paint these, um, glitter them. Mod Podge them. There's so many different things that you can do with these. Um, so I did get two packs of these. They come in a pack of eight each. Again, that's Crafter Square. Um, I got another color your own ornament, which is the um, carrots. Again, you could, it comes with a string, but you can also string these along and make garland out of them. Um, or you can do it as an ornament. Um, one of the things that I thought about doing this year is keeping up a small tree in my craft room up year round and kind of decorate, decorating it per season. So that may be something that I do. Um, again, these would also look good um, decorated and make it um, to put on a reef or a, um, a sign. So there's these things like this can be used in so many different DIY projects. 
Um, so I always try to pick up one, even though I may not have a purpose for it at the time. Um, that was all of uh, the crafting things that I got. Um, and of course, with this being a new store, I'm not sure I've not seen any really good books at any of my um, other stores, but this one had quite a few good books, so I picked up quite a few. Um, I got this one from Mark Cameron called The Stone Cross. Um, this one is from 2020. So again, these are $1.25. It's regular, regular $9.99. So put that in my collection. I got this one from Lisa Jackson. It's called Wicked Lies. It's Lisa Jackson and Nancy Bush. Regular $9.99, it's, it's pretty thick. Um, this is from 2011, so it's a little bit of an older book, but it's one I haven't read yet, so put that in my collection. Um, Janet Daly, Santa Sweetheart, $8.99 regular price. Um, I've read a couple of Janet Daly's books and I really enjoy them. Um, they're pretty easy reads. Uh, this is from 2021. Again, it's Santa's Sweetheart. Um, know Your Value. Um, from Mika. I'm not even going to pronounce that last name. But this is a signed copy. Which I thought was pretty neat. Uh, regular $26. Um, there's her signature. Um, and this is from, looks like, 2011. Um, the copyright on this one is actually 2018, so it's been printed a couple of times. But, um, you know, I'm in a transition um, period with my career, so I thought this would be a, a good um, opportunity to read this. I um, don't really know why I bought this one, but... It's not going to hurt to read. It's called Hello Girls by Brittany Cavallero and Emily Henry. Don't know anything about them, um, but thought I'd try. 2019 is the date on this one. So, yeah. And I like to read all kinds of different books. The only ones I can't read are like the really grotesque horror books. I can't, I can't do those. Gives me nightmares. Um, Lisa Charles, The Hunted, uh, regular price is $8.99, and this one looks to be from 2021, so it's a fairly new book. Another one I got was called Nancy Bush, it's called The Gossip, regular $8.99. It looks like all of these are made by, it says Zebra. Um, published by Kensington Publishing Corp. So, this is 2021. It's called The Gossip. Not heard anything about any of these books. Um, and then the last one I got, um, I know there was some controversy with her, so I think this is about that. But it's Didn't See That Coming by Rachel Hollis. I have not read any of her other books. Um, but... Um, anyways, I decided I'd, I'd get this and, and give it a try and see what's going on. Uh, regular $20. I know it's been released here in the last couple of years. Um, 2020. So, um, but yeah, that's my, and then I got a, a two liter drink. Um, but that's my haul from my Dollar Tree. Um, the new one that opened up, um, right up the street from me. But um, I hope you enjoyed just watching through one of my hauls. Like I said, I'm a shopaholic. You might see quite a few of these um, along the way. Just, um, yeah. So, anyways, until next time.